Hello everyone, my name is Joelle. Welcome to my yoga channel. Lesson 37, to relieve tight calves. If you like the class, please subscribe. We will begin kneeling, feet hip distance apart. Let's send the, the hips back towards the heels. Tuck the toes, forehead on floor, arms extended, palms facing down. Let's take a deep inhale and a deep exhale. We are starting the class with child pose. Tucking the toes activates the foot meridian points by actively stretching the muscles and connecting the tissue of the feet. It's a perfect therapy for flat feet and lower back pain. Doing this pose stretches shoulders and spine without overstretching the lower back. This pose gently opens the lower back without hyper stretching. Let's take a deep inhale and a deep exhale. Breathe. Focus on your breath throughout the practice. Your breath is your anchor. Let's take a deep inhale and a deep exhale. From here, keep the toes tucked and send the hips back and up into downward facing dog. Let's uh, bend one knee and then the other. Gently pedal out your feet one at a time, stretching into hamstrings, calves, Achilles, and feet. Inhale and exhale. Let's bend one knee and then the other. Let's bend one knee and then the other. Let's uh, bend uh, both knees and place them on the mat. We go into all fours. Let's uh, keep our toes uh, tucked for more stability. Stack your wrist, elbows and shoulders Stack knees above your hips. Inhale, arch the back, drop the belly, look forward. Exhale your hands into the floor, round the back. Inhale, arch the back, drop the belly, look forward. Exhale, press your hands into the floor, round the back. Inhale, arch the back, drop the belly, look forward. Exhale, press your hands into the floor, round the back. Inhale, arch the back, drop the belly. Exhale, round the back into cat. Inhale, into cow. Exhale, into cat, round the back. Inhale, into cow, drop the belly, arch the back. Exhale, round the back into cat. From here, keep uh, toes tucked, hands on mat. Send the hips back and up into downward facing dog. Press firmly through your palms and knuckles. Press the bases of your index finger actively into the floor. The forearm rotated internally and the arms rotated externally. Draw your lower ribs in, belly in and up and stretch your back. Maintain a flat back. If your heels do not touch uh, the floor, some of the factors that can play a role in whether your heels can not uh, reach the floor are related to tight calves, hamstrings and hips. The reality is, if your heels do not touch the floor, it's not actually a problem at all. You could have your heels on the floor and be doing zero work. Or you could have your heels uh, uh, now 
uh, here near the floor and be doing so much work to get uh, to the primary action of lengthening the spine. From here, let's release, place the knees on the mat, send the hips back towards the heel, forehead on the mat, arms extended, big toes touching and knees wide, child pose. Inhale and exhale. Take a deep inhale and a deep exhale. Tuck the toes, send the hips back and up into downward facing dog. Bend both knees, step to the front of the mat, inhale flat back, hands on shins, exhale fold. Let's uh, go into Pada Hastasana. We slide the hands under the feet for forward fold. You can keep your knees bent, you lift your feet up and slide the palms of your hands underneath your feet. Walk the toes all the way up towards the crease of your wrist as you press forward into the toes and the toes into the wrists. Let's place our hands in opposite elbows and we bend the knees and we sway from side to side. Let's inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Let's uh, inhale. Place uh, one hand in front of your foot. Take a gentle bend in the same side leg. Exhale to extend your opposite arm into the sky and twist to one side. Torso upward and gaze up. Let's inhale center. Exhale, twist to the other side. Inhale, center, twist to one side, inhale, center, and let's bend both knees, lift up one vertebrae at a time. Let's stand in Tadasana, inhale and exhale. Let's inhale and exhale. Grab from here, grab your tennis uh, ball. We are going to need it to massage the feet. Place the ball under your foot and slowly roll from side to side so the ball goes across your uh, arch. Next, roll the ball from heel to toe, covering the length of uh, your foot. Let's uh, inhale and exhale rolling a tennis ball under the arch of your foot helps massage and stretch the plantar fascia a band of tissue fascia that connects your heels bone to the base of your toes let's change sides and we roll the tennis ball from side to side and heel to toe covering the length of your foot rolling a tennis ball under the arch of your foot helps uh, massage and stretch the plantar fascia Let's grab a blanket and roll it one time. We are going to stretch the calves. Place the blanket underneath feet. Place uh, the balls of the feet and toes on a folded blanket. Let the heels rest on the floor. Stand up tall and look straight ahead. Straighten your legs. Lift your kneecaps upward to firm your thigh muscles. Engage your core and lengthen your tailbone. Breathe into your back body and lift your sternum. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Enjoy the stretch. Inhale and exhale. If the next pose is uh, too much, you can remain in this pose and enjoy the stretch. 
Otherwise, continue on with me. Let's place the blocks uh, in front of us. Let's inhale, hands out, round and up. Exhale, forward fold, hands on blocks. Any height that feels comfortable for you. Inhale, flat back, hands uh, on blocks. Exhale, hands on block, fold Press the balls of the feet and toes into blanket to rise up. Activate the core. Inhale, hands out, round and up. Exhale, hands to heart, samastitihi. Let's uh, inhale and exhale. From here, let's uh, grab a strap and we uh, first we place uh, our blanket uh, to the side. And uh, we place the blocks uh, to the sides and we go into Uttita Hasta Padengustasana to stretch the legs and ankles. Let's grab a strap, stand in Tadasana. Inhale and exhale. Place the strap under the ball of the right foot. We raise the right knee to chest, extend the right heel and raise the leg. From here, inhale and exhale. From here, move the strap to the left hand and twist to the right. Open the right hand while twisting. Let's release. Let's release. Stand in Tadasana. Inhale and exhale. Let's change sides. You can press the pause button if you need more time. If you can't achieve the harmony of balance at the moment, please refresh your balance by pausing the video, by refocusing and recentering. We stand, uh, we place the strap under the ball of the left foot. We raise the left uh, knee to chest, extend the left heel and raise the leg. And from here, move the strap to the right hand and twist to the left. Let's uh, release. We place the strap uh, to the side and we go into all fours and sit. Extend uh, your legs, belly in and up. Grab your strap and flex feet. Place the strap on the balls of the feet. Open the toes and spread them out and hold the strap with both hands and pull your feet towards you as much as you possibly can. Enjoy the stretch in the calf and Achilles tendon. Let's release. Inhale and exhale. Let's uh, grab the blocks and place them in front of us. Let's uh, place one block uh, vertical and the other block uh, horizontal on top. Let's open both legs out to, th to the sides. Flex both feet. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Raise both arms up and fold over. Place your forehead on the block. Inhale and exhale. Enjoy the stretch. Inhale and exhale. Flex the feet, palms of the hands uh, on floor, forehead on blocks. Enjoy the stretch. Take a deep inhale and a deep exhale. A deep inhale and a deep exhale. Enjoy the stretch. From here, uh, relax uh, the feet, inhale and exhale while relaxing the whole body 
inhale and exhale from here let's go on our backs into half happy baby we bend the both knees feet flat on the floor bring your right knee close to your right chest and raise the sole of the right foot towards the ceiling so that the thigh is perpendicular to the floor flex the raised foot and catch it with your right hand keep your left knee bent inhale and exhale let's take a deep inhale and a deep exhale have happy baby Let's take a deep inhale and a deep exhale. Let's uh, release and uh, change uh, sides. We bend both knees, feet flat on the floor. Bring your left knee close to your left chest and raise the sole of the left foot towards the ceiling so that the thigh is perpendicular to the floor. Flex the raised foot and catch it with your left hand. Keep your right knee bent. Inhale and exhale. From here, let's go into full happy baby, clasping the feet and drawing the knees towards the floor while keeping the sacrum on the floor and the heels are lined over the knees. Move the spine from side to side and massage the back. Inhale and exhale. And from here, let's grab the big toes and stretch the legs out. Inhale and exhale. Enjoy the stretch. Inhale and exhale. From here, supportive bridge pose. Lie on your back with your knees bent. Feet flat on the floor and the heels uh, below the knee. Feet parallel. Press down into the sole of your feet to lift your hips uh, off the floor. Grab a block, place it on low height. Place the block directly under your sacrum. Let your weight relax on the block. Arms uh, by the sides. From here, if you feel stable, try lifting one leg off the floor. Point and flex. Point and flex. Inhale and exhale. Let's uh, point and flex. Let's place the foot on the floor and change the sides. Point and flex. Point and flex. Let's point and flex. Point and flex. We can make circles, change the direction of the circles. And uh, from here, after uh, changing sides, we uh, place uh, the foot on the floor. If you are up to the challenge and you feel stable, try lifting one leg off the floor and the other while keeping the block in place under your sacrum. Uh, straighten your lifted uh, legs up to the ceiling, flex and point, flex and point. Inhale and exhale. From here, carefully place both feet flat on the floor. Let's uh, bend the both knees, extend our left leg out, flex our left foot and root the heel into the floor. Keep your right knee uh, bent towards your chest, hands uh, on your right knee, point and uh, flex your right uh, foot, point and flex, point and flex. Let's uh, change uh, sides. Let's change sides. Let's point and flex, point and flex. Point and flex, point and flex. 
inhale and exhale we can make circles with the foot uh, change the direction of uh, the circles to come out of this uh, pose press down into your feet and lift your hips up slide the block out from uh, uh, under your sacrum and gently lower your back to the floor and uh, place the block to the side. From here, grab your strap to go into Supta Padangustasana A. Lying supine, place your strap on the ball of your left foot, flex foot, and open the toes. Holding the strap with both hands, gently pull on the strap and enjoy stretching the hamstrings, calves, and inner thighs. Let's uh, inhale and exhale. Let's uh, place the foot on the floor and we extend the, the leg. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Let's uh, change uh, sides. We grab our strap to go into Supta Padangustasana A. Lying supine, place your strap on the ball of the right foot. Flex the uh, foot and open the toes, holding uh, the strap with both hands. Uh, gently pull on the strap and enjoy stretching the hamstrings, calves and inner thigh. Inhale and exhale. Enjoy the stretch. Inhale and exhale. Let's uh, release. And we place the uh, strap uh, to the side. Let's uh, hold the, the big uh, toe and enjoy the stretch. We bend both knees and uh, we hold the big toe and we enjoy the stretch let's uh, change side let's uh, hold the big toe and we extend uh, the leg Holding the big toe, enjoy the stretch. We keep the other knee uh, bent. And from here, let's uh, bend both knees, place hands on knees and move back and forth and sit up. Let's uh, grab the block and the uh, tennis ball sitting on the floor with hands on floor and simply massage the ball into the calf, rolling it uh, from uh, side to side, back and forth. Change sides whenever you're ready. Sitting on the floor, we do the same with the hands on the floor. Massaging back and forth. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Massaging the ball into the calf to relieve tight calves. Inhale and exhale. And uh, from here, let's, uh, 
We go into all fours, palms on the floor, hands facing knee, tuck the toes and gently make uh, little circles, massaging the wrists and toes. Inhale and exhale, change the direction of uh, circles. We go into all four, palms on the floor, hands facing knees, tuck the toes and gently make little circles, massaging the wrists and toes. Inhale and uh, exhale. And from here, let's uh, bend uh, both knees and we go into our final resting pose, Shavasana. Resting the hands along the side the body, feet little wider than hips, drawing shoulder blades uh, under. Sacrum heavy, head heavy, body sinking into the floor beneath you. Relax the jaw, the eyes, arms and legs, resting here in Shavasana. Quiet mind, quiet body, Shavasana. From here, move the fingers and toes. Interlace the fingers and stretch your body. Bend both knees and fold to one side, resting head on arm. Inhale and exhale. Push yourself up with both hands. Sit in a comfortable seat hands in prayer to heart center. Place the hands on your forehead. Namaste.